Hello then and welcome to my fourth video blog. Yes, I only recorded one yesterday, it must have been, but I have not long ago been watching BBC News to watch Alistair Darling. If you don't know who he is, he's basically the Chancellor of Great Britain. Not a very good one, I have to say, but he's basically going to get Britain into lots and lots of debt. More debt than any, than any country could need, but at the moment it's, well, a lot, and it's apparently going with the tourists to get the one trillion mark, and you got to think, well, how are we going to hell are we going to pay that back? But they come up with some ideas like to sort of in, make, make, hope, make people spend more money, which I believe is not going to work. Like it's going to cut, cut VAT from 18.5% down to 15%, which in my opinion, opinion doesn't make any difference for what's that, what's that a couple of pence? Which is, which is nothing, so what, what is that going to do? And what else is he going to do? Well, most of the things he did say he's going to do won't affect anything whatsoever, to be honest. This will be lots more debt. And how can, like, borrowing more money make things better? Because it means, in, like, after the recession's gone, we're all going to have to pay off some of these taxes. Are going to go from, like, being that to, sort of, boom, basically. So, in the long run, it's going to make matters even worse. And, and as the Tories are saying, it's always time after you come in and fix it. Because you have Labour in power, and then all they do is, is totally screw the economy up, basically. And then the Tories have to come back and, and fix all the mess again. So why people vote Labour, I have no idea. And, well... Gordon Brown, who's now our leader, who was the Chancellor in the first place, said it was the end of um, Boom and Bust, as he put it, but, well, how wrong was that? And of course, he has a habit of, like, blaming um, American, you know, it's not my fault, but he was the Chancellor, so it was his fault, because it happened on his watch. And as well, as you probably heard if you listened to one of my video blogs, not my video blogs, my podcast, even, my work, next, not my next one, just have Christmas going down to a 3D week instead of a 4D week. And again, whose fault was that? Oh, it's Gordon Brown's and the twats at Labour. So the sooner we vote them out, the better. And if you're a Labour supporter, I am sorry, but you are silly for voting for them because they are a waste of space, basically. Anyway, <laughs> I've had that little rant out the way. I'm going to say goodbye, but that's my opinion on the budget. Stupid and it's going to cost us a hell of a lot to pay it back. So that's it for now. As you can tell, I'm a little bit irritated. But next time I do our video pod, blog, I'll speak about something hopefully a bit later. Bye for now.